Uh, hello, I am Reaverbot. I'm doing a water roulette, but for once, I am not alone, and I don't have Frocto with me. Who do I have with me? This is Ever Downward, this, ladies and gentlemen. This is Ever Downward, our music thief, and we're playing. Uh, <laughs> what is this game doing? Uh, I'm not going to read the text <laughs> file for this. Uh, and by the way, the person with me, I just got killed. Has never seen this before. <laughs> so that like, was. Very pathetic, by the way. That was amazing. I, I just wanted to show off that if you go in that door, you're basically going to die because you start with a pistol. This is Fifty One by a guy named George Fifty, also known as King Relol. King Relol is pretty notorious for making very early wads. He made a lot of wads early in Doom's lifespan, but uh, none of them were ever very good, even for the time. And he is also pretty notorious for uh, being a gigantic fucking drama whore. Anyway, that, that's all I got to say about him. If you want to know any more, just uh, check out the Essaycopedia on something awful. Anyway, here we are. We're in, a, we're in a big silver room, and there's a lot of rooms, and I'm shooting guys. There's certainly a lot of variety here. Yeah. You know, I mean, look, we got shotgunners there in the corner, and amazing. oh, and then we had some imps over there before. I just noticed that. Lots of closets. Yeah. There, here's a room. <laughs> Here, here's the hallway. This is the best, oh, way, to, oh, hello. This is the best way to start out a lot. Yeah, pretty much. With like a whole bunch of monsters in one giant area and with a whole bunch of what, weapons. This, what more do you nothing screws originality like that, does what it? What more do you need? Uh, seriously, I mean, just one big gigantic fuck fest. This is the only health in this little area right here, so I'm going to have to... I, I, oh, that's pretty pathetic. I didn't actually fill and, it up. I don't know about you, but I never even pick up the berserk items because I always find them too just wasteful. My screen's all red and shit. I picked them up if I'm almost dead because they give me 100 health. Really? I yes, didn't know that. They, they bring you back to full health. Oh, fuck. Yes. Here we go. And now I, I can actually kill this, this fucking yeah, you'll pink be... roadblock. <laughs> you'll be fine now. You got the yeah. shotgun. You're good. And my... I'm going gonna... I'm gonna to cut this part out, so let's just talk. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, he's going to die. And we're going to I, be I don't... Yeah, that was... Eight... <laughs> <laughs> what? Just <Ow. laughs> what? No, nothing. Nothing. Like, uh, take some armor. Uh, I just wanted to save because I mean I don't want to play this wad more than I have to. So I go into this hallway and I'm just thinking, oh, oh hello. Well, that wasn't what surprised me. <laughs> this is. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> it's pretty common. He puts these in all of his wads, just like everywhere. What bothered me was I forgot that I picked up some ultra vision earlier on in the level. So I think this is just a normal hallway, when in reality, it is pitch black, and oh, you cannot see anything in here. Man. Oh, I love these rooms. What? There's nothing it else served, in this room. <laughs> served no purpose. It was, it was just barrels and, and pinkies. Yeah, 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 but surely there's going to be oh, more in this room. Oh, wait, it's not different at all, is oh, it? There's more. Oh, wait, that one got away. No, he didn't. Oh, he didn't. Um, uh, I don't think there's anything else in this room. I can't. I just, how could how could you see while you're while this is going on? If you on? press you up see? against the wall, you can uh, it, it sort of like gives you light briefly. Oh yeah, and all these rooms are dark now because I don't have ultra vision. Oh, except for that one. So we're back in the beginning. Yes, we are actually about to go to the second area of the map, and it is fortunately the exact same thing as the first area of the map. Oh, we have different <laughs> wall textures yeah, now. That's that important. There's actually one closet here that. Uh, shares a uh, wait. It, the thing is, it doesn't share a texture with anything else in the level, and that is what I want to really know, bothering me. What I want to know is why is it there's a room full of M's, but then there's just one gecko demon just, in there. Just, I, I don't know. <laughs> you, you're just like hanging you're out. Th you're he thinking does. too hard. I think you're thinking harder than he did when he made this. It just it just bothers me. That's all. <laughs> there's two backpacks. There's two. Ba there's never a reason for more than one backpack in a level. <laughs> no, there isn't. Uh. This is actually a, a nice little room. I mean, it's very cliche, but other than that, it, it sort of mixes up the rest of the level. Yeah, it's a variety. Creativity. Yes. Always good. Level. Let's do. I mean, I could see that in the middle of hell. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> For some reason, you know, Icon of Sin has shotgunners and imps. Uh, and a yeah. <laughs> pretty much. He, he's not... He's not actually that. He doesn't usually resort to just these rooms like the first two that he just did, where everything is exactly the same and it's just a bunch of monster closets. Oh, God. One thing I want to say is that one of the biggest problems is that you can't really tell any of them apart. You get all disoriented, and you just have to open doors and hope it's the right one. 
Here, here's the one that uh, has the floor that looks nothing like anything else in the level. <laughs> just, just... Uh, There's also a staircase. Cool. I love staircases. Oh, yeah, look. I, I wouldn't have seen that before, either. Yeah. It's amazing. Just, the, just a uh, red room. Some good strafing there. Some good yes. strafing. I'm actually very good at uh, strafing. And a pit. A giant pit. Oh, look. Look what we have. Yankees <laughs> and barrels. It's creative. It's his trademark. Uh, other trademark is... Oh, oh, I got a berserker pack. Needlessly gigantic elevators. <laughs> <laughs> it reminds me of that one place in Mach 2 where you, you uh, hit an elevator, and it takes literally like three minutes to come down and three minutes to go back up. I think the most ridiculous thing about that is that you just picked up the berserk pack, right? Yeah. And it probably took about 20 seconds in its entirety for the elevator to come down and to come back up. So you've essentially just lost your berserk well, power up. See, I, that's actually I actually now I have a, a chance to be informative. Thank you very much, Ever Downward. You're welcome. Because uh, <laughs> the berserk effect actually does not go away when you, your screen stops being red. It sticks with you throughout the rest of the level. I don't exactly know what the red screen is for, but you'll notice that when you still punch things after you uh, pick up a berserk pack, they will still explode. I I actually do not know that. So that is important. A lot of my people bad. don't know that. Which is, I guess, I'm just better than them. <laughs> <laughs> so I just, I'm just, it's up. I can't remember which door I need to go through. I saved here, but I didn't really need to. I love how you use the map for like a split. I accidentally hit just... the key. Shut up! <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything about oh, that. Uh, he's getting bigger and bigger. He's getting more bold with the think he's in the barrel. <laughs> <laughs> he's inflating. Oh yeah, you could just pick up all that armor, even Wait. though I have two hundred percent. Yeah, there's a mega armor there, and then there's more. <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> I don't know. And another backpack. Why not? Just throw it in there. And a blue room. Is that the a yellow key cool? that I literally do. You know, I I do use the yellow key. I was about to say I don't use the yellow key, but I do use the yellow key. I never find the blue key. Never. Nope. Wow. But I don't need to. I don't know why. I don't know what that entire branch of the level is for. <laughs> anyway, we're going back. It's, it's just for it's just it's just uh, for shits and giggles. Yeah, that's all. Why not? Just to show off his prowess as a pinky and barrels guy. <laughs> that's my trailer. Trying to make my name in the Doom world. <laughs> it's, it's his name. He's gonna write his name in barrels. With it. George Fifty. What? What? what, what oh. A name? oh. Oh boy, a room oh, that totally that? makes me like literally that's physically my... ill. In the hallway of darkness too, and there's a bear in a bell. Oh, Fantastic! Up all your bullets. <laughs> and he's hiding. <laughs> Surprise! You, I'm trying to run away. Stop! See, I hate this wall texture. It makes it feel like everything's <laughs> pulled out the pistol for by accident. <laughs> Everything looks like it's moving, and it like literally makes me nauseous when I go in here. Uh, uh, and oh, there he is. God, yeah, yeah, the moving wall text just pisses me off. Hopefully soon I'm going to find the blue K. I hope you find the exit, yeah. yeah. I, I mean, K this was, is... Oh, wait, there it is. Oh, oh there it is. If you didn't know what the exit was, I mean, <laughs> we're just going to put 12 exit signs right there. <laughs> just, just, to, just to show you. Just to show you. Just to let you know what we're dealing with here.